Hey guys, it's Paul with you today, and today I want to talk about Sorn. This is this guy right here. He got the most amount of likes on my first video, and he talked. He asked a question about soreness in here, and I'm gonna be talking about delayed onset muscle soreness, which is what I think he's talking about. There's acute muscle soreness and delayed onset. Acute happens right dur during your workout or or right after. It's something uh, some people call the pump, and uh, delayed onset muscle soreness happens around 12. 24 to 72 hours after your workout and uh, it's just pain within your muscle the next day or the day after when your muscles are in pain after the workout. So why does that happen? Soreness is caused usually by unaccustomed exercise or exercise you're not used to doing. And what causes it is ultrastructural disruptions of myofilaments especially at the Z discs in the muscles connective tissue, skeletal muscle connective tissue. The interesting about it is um, Scientists are still trying to do research on the subject and are still not 100% sure on how exactly it happens and how to explain it, but this is the current research that they have. Um, soreness happens from eccentric exercises. Except eccentric exercises is when your muscle lengthens while under pressure. So right now I'm putting pressure on my, on my bicep and this is an eccentric exercise because my, my bicep is lengthening while it's under pressure. Concentric exercises is where your muscle shortens under pressure or under stress. So here I'm shortening my bicep, pulling my arm towards me. This is concentric exercise. This pulling out while under stress is eccentric exercise. Soreness is caused, caused by eccentric exercise, not concentric. Isometrics, which is uh, stress under one angle, just holding it like this, just stress. It also causes some soreness, but most of it's called by caused by eccentric exercises. Now, you might ask, what is what can we do to prevent muscle soreness? Now, it is advisable to gradually increase workout intensity. So, if you're beginning to work out, put on a little, make your workouts harder, little by little, every time you work out. Don't fully put all your strength into one workout when you're a beginner, because you're going to be sore for a very long time. Now, two. Um, prevent muscle soreness from happening just take it slowly don't go all out your first time you're gonna go work out so you have to take advantage of the bout effect or mu muscle adaption because your muscles adapt to the workout and it's much better uh, stretching or warming up does not prevent muscle soreness uh, because many people say it does and overstretching actually may cause muscle soreness uh, which is what many people teach that stretching or warming up helps it doesn't now when you're already sore, anything that increases blood flow to the muscle that is sore, like low intensity work, uh, hot baths, massage, sauna, they all help. And uh, some research shows, although not everyone agrees with this, but from personal experience here, putting all research aside, concentric exercise, lightweight, like not going heavy, just easy concentric exercise actually decreases soreness. So next day when you're sore, do some concentric exercise with a little bit of weight that will decrease muscle soreness because in my opinion it's caused because the the blood rushes into the sore muscle so that that's what helps and muscle repair and soreness are indi indirectly related to each other so your muscles may be finished healing after your workout but you're still sore or your muscles may not be finished Complete, uh, finished repairing after all the rips you've made and you won't be sore so uh, soreness does not affect muscle repair your muscles might be repaired and you'll, you'll be sore or your muscles might still not be repaired and you'll be sore and also uh, one last thing is that you can work out while sore if you gave enough time for your muscles to repair but it might cause injuries because your muscles not the muscles connective tissue is not fully repaired not every single part of it is repaired so uh, conclusion muscle soreness is the ultrastructural disruptions of myofilaments especially the z disc of muscles connective tissues while muscle uh, repair is when you work out your muscle rips and the repairs which gives you strength is different there and related. They are related but indirectly related. So there you go. 
it's Paul with you today, The Fortress Truth. Subscribe. Uh, more is coming. Check out my last video right here. And I'll see you guys later. Alright, check out my other channel. There I posted recently a video of my sister, a motivation video, if you guys want to check that out. And I'll see you guys later. Comment below. Highest rated up comment with the question, short question. I will answer in detail. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.